Welcome to you, to Villa Park, the home of Aston Villa Football Club in Birmingham, big city in the middle of England. Martin Tyler here along with Alan Smith. Premier League football we have for you, it's coming right up. Aston Villa against Sheffield United. Yeah, real buzz around this ground, full house, a lot of interest in it. Hope it doesn't disappoint. Really anticipating something special from him here today. Well, he's a crowd pleaser because when he gets the ball, you just don't know what's going to happen. So many possibilities with him in possession. The Aston Villa team for this game. We put it up as a 5-2-3. It could be 3-4-3, couldn't it, if the wide players get forward from the back? Yeah, I think it's one of those. It could be anything the manager wants it to be he has got some very talented lads out there though for sheffield united today well we put it up and what looks alan very defensive but there's flexibility isn't there in the side yeah and i think with his shape so much depends on the wing backs how much they are allowed to get forward and what they can do when they do get forward. Thank you, Villa Park. Enjoy the night. One of the Premier League ever presents from its inception in 1992 until the most awful of seasons 15, 16, and relegation, rock bottom. And somebody who has Villa in his heart, Alan, what did you make of it? Well, it's just been a, a tale of woe, hasn't it? It's been a disastrous few years, really. and So sad because it's a big club, as we know, and they should be doing a lot better. Grealish. Mbwana Ali Samata. Looking to use the full width of the pitch in this attack. Coming into the penalty area now. He made that look like a poor pass with a very good interception. Well, this could be dangerous in a wide position. Chance to put it in the box from here. Headed it well, but just wide. Well, not far wide at all. Next time, maybe he'll bury that. Anwar El Ghazi. Drink water. El Ghazi. Mbwana Ali Samata on the attack here. Impressive in possession. Passing's good, possibly dangerous. Delivered into the box. I had a chance really to put that into a much more dangerous area. Has to go down as a poor cross. Norwood. John Fleck. Now, can he take them on? Oliver Norwood. Opportunity to cross it now. Good interception. Well, no one's picking him up in the wide area. This could be dangerous. A couple of teammates up in support. Grealish. Anwar El Ghazi. John Fleck. Oliver Norwood. Sander Berger. It's a real opportunity to get it into the middle. Nothing wrong with the industry of the team. That little bit of inspiration lacking that they need to get their noses in front.
Berger. Sander Berger. Comes in strongly. And that's gone out for a throw in. Mbwana Ali Samata. Now target. An opportunity here. There's some space to work the ball into. That's hit the bar and it's still in play. Now Billy Sharp. Norwood. Berger. Guiding it through. What a save from Reina. There's the breakthrough. Oh, what a good move and what a good finish that is. Oh, I always used to love scoring these type of goals when you're there first. It feels good, this. Well, here's the goal again. Sheffield United with the lead. Here's the goal again. Basham. Norwood. It's good play, this. The opposition can't get at them when they're keeping the ball. He's got support in the centre. Well, he took it on, Alan, didn't he, from a tight angle. Trying to catch the keeper unawares, I think. Sanderberger. Trying to catch the keeper unawares, I think. On the fleck. Attacking now. Bit of keep ball going on here. And he gets it. A real opening for him. What a good way to score. It's got to go down, I think, as one of the goals of the season because it wasn't just about the finish. It was that marvellous build-up play. So many players involved in it. No better time to score than that, and no wonder his teammates are delighted. Let's see the replay now. Just widen the margin here to 2 0. Referee's had a good look and decided from what he's seen from this uh, period of play to add on three minutes. Jack Grealish. So easy in possession. Oh, the attackers come in near post. Looking a problem until the clearance was made. Anwar El Ghazi. He could cross it now. Half time now, and 2 0 is the score at the break. He's doing more, isn't he, than just keeping them ticking over in midfield. He's, he's running the show. Yeah, they've really got to get closer to him. As you can see, he's been receiving the ball in good areas in the middle of the park. and. That assist that he uh, contributed was a beauty. The second half is off and underway. Oliver Norwood. John Fleck. 
And the referee lets them go on. Advantage played by him. It's good work here in terms of possession. Can they find the final pass? On the attack with real gusto a moment or two ago, but it rather left them dismayed in the end. Excellent interception. Now, I think we've seen it. The visitors controlling possession. And the way they've played, the way they've been clinical in front of goal, it's difficult to see a way back for the opposition if they can continue in this vein. They've been so good out here today. Frederic Gilbert. They're looking good when they attack. Blocked off the pass there. Referee's done uh, extremely well to judge it like that. He can play the advantage. Referee has blown and he's given the free kick. Well, they are behind, so it's time for a change. They've got to try and improve their performance somehow. Oliver Norwood. Norwood. Sanderberger. And the away team want to make a change. Oliver Norwood. Berger. Oh, they couldn't keep possession. They've given it away. Well, we're two-thirds of the way through the 90 minutes. Half an hour to go. There's going to be some uh, alteration to the structure for Villa. The substitute's going to come on. Got his foot in to cut out the pass. He's got it in behind the defenders for the attacker to chase. Oh, got his angles wrong with the pass. Well, he's read that, hasn't he, and made the interception. Made it look easy, actually. Now target. Grealish. It's Matt Target. Well, here they are, still probing away. Drink water! Well, there's a twist to the tail here. They've cut the deficit in half. They're only one behind now. There's still plenty of time to try and find this equaliser. What a strike that was. Well, he's got a track record of that. On his left side, he's so dangerous. Another angle on it here. Off we go again, 2-1. Goal for Aston Villa, number four, Danny Drinkwater. And 20 minutes to go. Sharp, John Fleck. Norwood, it's a pass, another pass, at the moment just giving them possession and not much more than that. Trezeguet. Mbwana Ali Samata. Quick-witted and quick in his movement too to intercept there. John Fleck. Well, they put the squeeze on and stopped the opposition playing out. Now he could play it into the danger area. A good run towards the near post. Decent distance from the punch from the goalkeeper. And the manager, Alan, is making this change here. Substitution will take place. Well, he's done his bit. He got the goal that put his team in the lead. Can they hold that lead?
But here comes the corner. It's not really away from the threat here. Berger. Trying to get behind the defenders to get in a good cross. Well, it will be a throw-in. He's a good player, isn't he, this boy? He's coming off now, Alan, but uh, he's controlled the midfield. He has. He's, he's dictated it with his passing, the tempo of his passing. He's got his team on the front foot. And this is a good opportunity to put the ball into the penalty area now. And the goalkeeper, it's his ball. Well, the atmosphere's improving now. Now the home team need to improve. They're still in with a shout. Yeah, time is running out. It's now or never. I think they've got to lift the game. Could be a cross here. It could be dangerous. He's got it away, and that's what you have to do. Now target. Well, you can't knock these fans. They're doing everything possible to get behind their team here. Drink water. The crowd uh, may be expected a bit more, but it's two added minutes. Still trying to get forward here. Still trying to get the goal that can help them to some sort of salvation in this match. Well, the game has run its course here, and there's the final whistle. Well, they got there in the end. Mighty, mighty close, but the right result. Yeah, I think that's true, Martin. Yeah, they contributed plenty, scored a few goals, and, and just edged it for me. Well, I think he was the best performer in a good team today. Good performance from him, and uh, I think that was probably the difference between the two teams.